hey guys and welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be sharing with you how to apply for your credential evaluation with wes if you watch this video you know that wes is one of the credentialing body that iag requires so there's three of them but i will be looking on west today so here is the west website you can type world education services in google you should be able to find it it tells you the three steps that you should do step one submit your application step two you need to read your document requirements you can click that link so you can see what those requirements are before you go ahead and start applying and then step three to verify your documentations so today we're going to be looking on how to do that if you click on required documents you can go ahead and fill this section out as i said earlier and once you fill that section out you should be able to get a list of things that you will need for completing your credential evaluation with wes so there i am putting in those information so i can see what is it that they would need from me Once you hit that view requirement tab, it will show you a list of things that you would need to complete your application and also very, very important information that you will need to read so that you are on top of your game. Please note also your transcript should not be sent from you to us but should be sent directly from your institution. You want to read these information carefully so that you are aware of what should be done. Once you are clear on what is required from you, you can hit that start application tab and you will be directed to create an account with Wes. You start with your email address and from there, the different steps will be given and a verification code will be sent to your email address. You will use that verification code to confirm your email address and then you should be able to continue with your application process. Once you put that verification code in, you're gonna hit the submit code tab and it will take you to a page where you're now going to create your account with your names, your first name, your last name. You want to make sure you're spelling those just as they are on your degrees and transcripts, as well as creating a password that you can use to go back into WES several times after. And please remember, your credential evaluation is valid for up to five years after you have paid for the services. Once you have completed that area, then you're going to hit that create button and then it will take you to another page, which will allow you to put more details in about yourself. 
please know that you do not have to do all of this at once. You can start and take a break and come back to it a next time. You want to make sure you put your password in a secure place so that you can log back in after you want to continue your application. You're now being asked, why do you need this service? It's definitely for employment. And also you're going to want to read the information carefully to make sure you're doing what is required of you. Once you have done that, then you're going to need to add your credentials. And if you have more than one degrees outside of the United States, you can add all those degrees here to be evaluated for one cost. So once you put that first degree in, you hit save and then you add your other degrees. There's your option to hit that button to add another credential if you need to. So the next thing you're going to need to add after this is your address as well as your recipient address. In this video, I had skipped the recipient address, but I will come back to it and put that in. But you can put all of that in all at once. Your address and you can decide if you would like to get a copy of your evaluation transcript as well. Also, remember to put your recipient address and ensure that you type that properly so that when we send that credential evaluation over, they have the correct information, email address as well as physical address. That's what they require. As I mentioned in my previous video, you need to apply for a course by course evaluation. That is what IAG requires. WES will make recommendation as to what they think you should apply for, but please note you need a course by course evaluation. So when you get to this page, you're going to select other options. There's a link right under this area that says other available evaluation packages. You're going to hit that and you're going to hit the one that cost $208. That's the one that is the course by course evaluation. Please remember you need a course by course evaluation. So you're going to select, hit that button, select under the figure that says two. Oh, eight.
once you've selected that you're gonna go to the next page where again they're gonna show you what your requirements are what is it they need from you to complete your evaluation please note that once you put this application in and you pay it is not complete until west receives your credentials from your institution again they show you a checklist of documents that you need or things you can upload and you should not upload your transcript by yourself allow your institution to send that directly to west so you are then allowed to review your application. You want to make sure it says course by course, as you see, I have there. You want to make sure all your information is correct. And then you want to acknowledge the application. You read these different areas, you check them and you move on. You will be asked to confirm your name and date of birth. This is your time again to make sure those are correct and they match what is on your credentials. Once you get here, you can select your type of payment and you can pay. So this was done just to show you, so I'm not gonna be paying, but you can also play around with this to see how it works just in case you save it and come back to it once you hit save and exit you should be able to log back in and also edit different areas if you need to So again, if you don't remember your requirements, you can always go back there and look what the requirements were. You can also add a resume if that's something you'd like to do. And it tells you the reason or the purpose of adding a resume to the platform. So that's it for now, guys. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Also, if you have not subscribed to this channel as yet, go ahead and subscribe and share this video with somebody who might need some assistance in applying for their credential evaluation with WES, World Education Services. Thank you guys and I'll see you next time. Bye.